is Thresden. This is part eight of a World of Warcraft classic Tears Fall Glades walkthrough. In the last episode, I was dealing with a Forsaken whose minions were attacking other Forsaken. This guy is referred to as a Necromancer. And we went and stole his spellbook and brought it back to one of the NPCs here in Undercity. And this particular NPC told us to go back to him and try to convince this Necromancer to join the Forsaken. So that's what we're going to do right now. I'm going to use my Hearthstone here to go back to Brill. And then this particular person is very close to Brill. After I get through dealing with this uh, rogue Forsaken here, I'm going to go to this area to the east, which is the only area of Tears Fall Glades that we have not yet explored. I may also take this rear guard patrol quest right here. Make sure I've got bag space. Ah, not much. Not much bag space. I have exactly what you need. Do not seek death. I take that potion helps me regenerate health a little bit. In case I get into a fight. I had some problems with some previous videos. Dealing with the frame rate, I think it was two two episodes ago, the frame rate got really low. And so I lowered the graphics. Um, it looked fine when I was playing, but when I watched the video, it didn't look too good. So I apologize for that if you watched that video and uh, the low frame rate irritated you. it From looking at the previous video it looks like that problem is fixed so hopefully right now what you're seeing looks smooth oh this guy wants to fight huh Minion. Well, I'm actually in trouble now. I got cocky there. I was killing those things easily last time. But uh, I don't think I took on two of them at the same time. Try this again. Let's see, what is this? Oh, 
I've already, he's already got blood packed cast on him. didn't follow me. It means he must have gotten into a fight. Or he's dead. That's right, I forgot they killed him. I need to do here before I forget is to allocate another talent point there to this suppression because I leveled last time never did allocate that point all right I think I can get through here without pulling them and here is the infamous necromancer I am Gunther blessing. Arcanus he says, your masters are fools to send you here, for I will never again be a scourge slave. We don't want you to be a scourge slave, man. We just want you to join us. My book? So you were the thief who stole it. You know, it's funny because I stole this book right in front of him. I mean, he didn't even do anything to try to stop me. But what is this new enchantment upon it? Bethor? He is in Lordaeron? If he still exists, then perhaps he too escaped from the Lich King's grasp. You say you are not bound by the will of the Lich King, and the enchantment Bethor placed upon my book corroborates this. But before I believe you, I must have proof that you are the enemy to the Scourge. There is an old, bloody altar just off the southern coast of this island. It is used by a powerful Scourge agent, Lilith Nefara. Take a candle of beckoning from this crate here. Light it on the altar, and Lilith will awake. Destroy Lilith, and I will believe you are the Lich King's foe. Goodbye. Okay, I'll do it. Take a candle of beckoning from this crate, Thresdens. Alright. You grab one of the candles and place it in your pack. That's funny. Questy is showing me... Blue quests here, repeatable quests. That's that's interesting. I guess once I finish this, I'll be able to repeat it. I, I wonder what the reward is. Let's see what the reward is for the first one. doesn't show. Forgot, it doesn't show you the reward. Not in classic.
right now here's the altar this is an old beaten bloody table you place the candle of beckoning upon the table and light it you have disturbed my rest warlock now face my wrath Level 12. It's alright. If we had had more than one mob here, this would have been tough, but... It's not a problem now. Where's my minion? Is my minion dead again? Apparently, mindless zombies don't like water. Lucky for me. Defeated Lilith Nefara, proving you are, an, you are an enemy of the Scourge. Incredible. I had believed I was the only undead with free will, but you have shown me there are others who have broken the Lich King's domination. Take this nether gem to my old comrade, Vethor. It will let us communicate, and I have much to tell him. Bring the nether... Bring... The objective is to bring the nether gem to Vethor Ishard. Remember... And I'll get a bone buckler, which I don't need. Discipline. Alright, I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to this southern area. Because Under City is a long walk from here. Uh, my hearthstone is set to Brill, so I can't hearth back, and it's on cooldown anyway. For a long time. So I'm just going to try to finish as many of these quests as I can before we go back to Undercity. Wow, 
this is a vampiric dust bat. Instead of just a normal dust bat, it's a vampiric one. Who is this? Ah, oh, it's Peace Bull. Okay. It's always amazing to me how much easier it gets near the end of a zone. I know I said it last uh, last episode also, but um, I absolutely would have died right there earlier in the zone. All right, now I need to take this quest down here. I'm going to have to backtrack a little bit. I didn't realize that dust bat was neutral. Could have just avoided it. Target. That was a gray one. It gave no experience. So it was too low level. Just a nuisance. What is it? This is Death Guard Linnea. The defenders on the bulwark protecting Tears Fall from the Plague Lands are on constant alert. But sometimes Scourge will slip past them. Our success at the bulwark depends on a one front battle. We cannot allow an attack from the rear, nor can we allow our defender's supply line to be cut. Assist the bulwark. Patrol east and slay any scourge you find. Spend particular effort at the Valnir farmstead to the east. It has become a haven for inter interloping scourge. Beware, our enemies abound. Yes, they do. But that's all right. We got it under control. Alright, I've got to kill some Scarlet Friars, Captain Vachon, um, get some Vicious Nightweb Spider Venom, kill Bleeding Horrors, Wandering Spirits, and that's it. At that point, we'll go back and finally get to kill Magadai and the Agamon family, which we left from earlier. Right now, what is this here? Bleeding Horrors is what I'm looking for. Yeah. bag space. Looks like I'm okay for now. Alright. So the bleeding horrors look like Scourge.
Wow, this one's got a lot of health. Oh, she's level 11, that's why. Life tap first there and then cannibalized. Made a mistake. Oops. Should have got my minion to attack first, also. Mushrooms onto here for emergencies. Mob, Philicent's Shade, and I haven't gotten the quest to kill this thing yet. I need to try to avoid it until I'm sure I'll be sent on a quest to kill that at some point. like to cannibalize that corpse, but my cannibalize is still not off cooldown. Really need to get away from that area so that Philichin spirit doesn't repop and uh, cause me problems.
What? You mean you can't kill this one by yourself? See, my, my minion says sassy things to me sometimes. I don't like that. If I can get some uh, soul shards, I'll replace him with the Voidwalker. Matter of fact, I want to try that ability out. some other way to get soul shards later on because I really don't like that particular spell um, it doesn't look like it gives me soul shards very often anyway about how easy it had gotten, but then I went to the final area of the zone <laughs> where there's level 12 wandering spirits. take out the... Oh, oh! I don't have my minion summoned. happy about not having my health and mana full, but I think we'll be okay. Yes, yep, get your health back. That's a good demon. <laughs> There's no pet command. There's no pet social in WoW Classic. What a shame.
better back me up on this one. I always wonder, I mean, why would he say that? Obviously, I always back him up. Alright, that's all the bleeding horrors I need. I just need to kill wandering spirits now. Oh, and now he's speaking void language or whatever. progress. Two more wandering spirits and we'll be done with this quest. And we've just got to do the others. That's it. Now we need to kill Scarlet Friars and Captain Vachon himself. So I'm going to have to... Hmm. No matter where I go, there's things blocking my path. It's hard to determine what's the easiest way to go. So Captain Vachon should be somewhere over here. Uh-oh. Oh! I escaped just barely by the skin of my rotted teeth. And I am out of food. Wow, found some gear.
Got a nine armor Warnhide cloak, which is better than the Adept's cloak I was wearing. And a 15 armor simple gloves, which is better than the 11 armor heavy linen gloves that I did have. So I might just go around the mountain here. That might be easier than trying to cut through and getting attacked by a Scarlet Crusade right there. See, that is a Scarlet Zealot, and I need to kill the Friars. The Zealots are just in the way. See, that's what I need to kill. Oh, and they heal themselves. That's not good. I would assume that Captain Vachon would be inside of this keep here. And he is. He's only level 11. <sighs> this looks like it could be dangerous. Interrupted my spell. Yeah. bit concerned this might be like the Magadai Agamon family thing. I don't think it's that bad, but I'm starting to be a bit concerned. I don't want to waste a lot of time trying to kill Captain Vachon. We could be doing other things. water or food either. That body's decomposed, so I can't eat it.
It's a Scarlet Zealot. I don't want to fight those. I mean, here's the same two guys again. still chasing me. Oh, he died! Oh, wow. He died from the debuffs I put on him. How lucky can you get? I need a target. And my minion's not dead either? I pull that off. I need to repair my gear. But it's not red yet, so I guess it's okay. summon my minion. healing himself. seconds till I get to cannibalize again. Five seconds. Alright, let's kill some more friars. Good. You're exactly who I wanted to see. with the captain again. See if this is a friar. Nope, that's a zealot. Where, oh where, are the friars? Another zealot. What about this guy? Is this guy a friar? No, he's a zealot. The zealots have swords. They're a warrior class of Scarlet Crusade. The 
friars or priests. Let's see if I can go around the outside here to keep from pulling more zealots. going up mountains like this and not being able to see where I'm going. Right, zealot, friar. See if I can pull the friar without pulling the zealot. Probably not. Alright, seems to have worked. That was my alarm going off telling me to wake up. Obviously that's ridiculous because I'm awake, but uh, I apologize for the noise. Just one more friar. We can just find one more friar. We can be done with that quest. Now we still need vicious nightweb spiders. Those are over here, further to the east. I still have bag space. My armor is damaged, but not too badly. I think we can keep going. We can just find one more friar. There's a friar right there. Oh, two zealots right near him. That was an Alliance player. And he ran right by me. I took a swing at him, but he was too fast. Oh, all three of them. At this point, maybe some of the friars we killed earlier have respawned, like that one. Alright, we finished that quest. Sloppy way to finish it, but we did finish it.
Alright, now for the spiders. Killing these dust bats because they're in the way. It does look like we need to climb this hill here. And stay away from the Scarlet Crusade. There's the spiders. These should be easy. Cloak. 21 armor chest piece. Oh yeah, that's nice. Although I look like a clown in it, but that's okay. Actually, that kind of... That kind of looks cool. If only I didn't have a burgundy cape with a blue... What is that blue thing, anyway? I'm supposed to be wearing brown linen pants. Oh, it's... that's the robe? The robe has two parts. The top's white and the bottom is blue. Okay, whatever. That's weird. One bad thing about Classic is there's no transmogrification. Of course, I guess, once you get to level 60, you can do raids and get raid sets that match. So... people who really like classic would say <clears throat> that that's a good thing it's a symbol of status if your clothes don't match it means you have a haven't done any high level content so i understand that point of view still it would be nice while leveling 
be able to wear something that matches. resisted the urge to go back to town to repair my armor because that would have taken a long time and it looks like we're fine just got to get one more spider venom minutes left on the Hearthstone cooldown, so... Hmm... wonder what is up here? Scarlet Monastery! Okay, well, we definitely don't want to go there. But I might try to at least uncover it Matter of fact, I'm going to try it. I'd like to just uncover the map. Then maybe by the time we do that, the Hearthstone will have finished its cooldown go back to Brill. what I wanted. seconds. I think we're almost there. Monastery. Scarlet Watch Post. And there's the Meeting Stone. These are supposed to allow you to group up with people. It doesn't allow you to summon people like it does in retail, but it's supposed to allow you to group up with them, but I couldn't get it to work. Uh-oh. That guy's an elite. want to uncover the map. I don't want to fight anybody. Oh, great. 
Alright, well, I'm not uncovering the map, obviously. Before I turn in any quests, I'm going to go sell all of this junk I've accumulated. And you are. Ah. There's a belt that's better. Dried bat blood. Goodbye. Looks like I might be able to make some more items with tailoring as well. thread. That's no problem. I need 19 coarse thread. What now? Watch your back. Um, okay, so I didn't need that many coarse thread. That's fine, though. How many spaces do I have in inventory? Do I have nine? Two, three, four, five. Yeah, I got nine. That one turned yellow, so I'm gonna make gloves this time. All right, now I believe I have figured out how to get rid of herbalism. Unlearn this profession. Yes, I want to unlearn herbalism and go learn enchanting. Trainer is right here. What now? All right, here we go. I need a ruined copper rod. Well, I don't have that one. What do I have?
main thing is I need to disenchant all of this equipment right here. So let's see how I can do that. Um, how in the world do you disenchant something? Oh, here we go. Disenchant. You're kidding me! Item cannot be disenchanted. Well, that sucks. I guess I'll just vendor it then. Hello. All right, my enchanting skill, Dark lady, or not my enchanting skill, you. my uh, tailoring skill should be much higher now. It's up to 56. I can still make heavy linen gloves if I end up near the um near a tailoring trainer, I'll go learn some more patterns. But in the meantime, I need to turn in these quests. What would you ask of death? Executor Ziggin says, The Scarlet Crusade is encroaching on our homeland. The foolish zealots do not realize that the loyal servants of the Dark Lady shall see to their demise. Captain Vachon's death will slow down the Scarlet Crusade's advancement in Tirasfall quite a bit, but other threats loom. Scarlet Crusaders have been raiding from the ruined tower in northern Tirasfall, past Fail's Rest. According to the information we have, a ruthless commander named Captain Melrock is in charge of this evil crew. Melrock? Melrake? I am entrusting you now with a special and dangerous mission. Slay Melrake and his two bodyguards in the name of the Dark Lady. Trust no one. Alright. What is it? The Dark Lady has put forth the challenge. It is up to us to meet it. Do you have some venom from a vicious nightweb spider yet, Thresdens? It's the final component I need in order to test my experiment. Ah, this venom will do perfectly, Thresdens. Everything else has been added to my concoction and boiled down. Finally, I am ready to try this new deadly agent. Got an apprentice sash. According to the Death Guard, another one of those foolish dwarven mountaineers has just been captured. The Death Guard likes to use the cellar of the Gallows Inn Tavern as a holding cell until prisoners can be properly dealt with. Why don't you go see how the captured mountaineer enjoys this special drink I made for him? It contains a subtle hint of what the Dark Lady has planned for the rest of Azeroth. Alright. Victory for Sylvanas. 12 armor waste items, not as good as uh, what I already have. Johan special drink. Alright, I'm gonna go vendor this useless sash. What is it? And then let's let's go down into the cellar and give him Johan's special drink and see what happens. Last time, uh, the previous concoction that Johan made it turned the guy into this weird giant creature. It was this guy right here. Captured mountaineer. Says, why, if I had my trusted rifle, you'd be as good as dead, warlock. Just wait until the steam tank brigade arrives to rescue me. Oh, here. Ah, a drink at last. 
of course it's some it looks like an alcoholic drink right because it's a dwarf i'm sure it's no rhapsody malt but i'll take anything to wet the old whistle at this point i raise my brew and hope to be rid of the likes of you cheers you no good scoundrel thresdens and this time he just died he didn't turn into a undead creature or anything All right, I'd say the new plague is working. It's working quite well. All right, I'm gonna go to the front here, turn in this quest. I believe I also have a quest to turn in in Undercity. I am forsaken. Very good. Your efforts do much to keep the Scourge at bay. A commendation will be sent to my superior, Executor Zigand. Trust no one. Alright, great. And now I've got a new quest at Brill. Or no, I think it's the same one. Yeah, delivery to Silver Pine Forest. That's going to be the last quest we take before we leave. Right there. I need to get my armor repaired down here as well. Who's that? She almost looks human. I guess she's an undead or something. No! What the? What in the world? Is it some kind of cost? Probably a costume from Hallow's End or something. That was bizarre. says a human mage. What is a... I want to say, what is a human doing in Undercity? I'm going to ask on general defense. What is a human doing in Undercity? It's not a human, it's a consumable that makes them look human. Cursed by a pumpkin guy. <laughs> well, that's awful. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> She's just laughing. Alright, let's go turn in this quest. Or I get distracted here. Said she got cursed by a pumpkin guy. Poor girl. This is Bethor Ishard. Have you returned Gunther's book? Has he responded? You convinced him to join us. You have done a great deed for the Forsaken Thresdens. The Dark Lady will be informed. Dark Lady, watch over you. Alright. That's what I want. Want Sylvanas to know all that I am doing for the Forsaken. Alright. Let's find the blacksmithing trainer because he can probably repair my gear. Let's take a swim. Oh, see, now I've got another quest. This had better be good. A donation of wool. No, I need wool. Trust I'm no not one. giving you wool. Oh, he's a gun merchant. And he can repair my stuff. Good. Embrace the shadow. That is where all of that ooze comes from. Alright, I don't know what's going on there. People are sparring or something, but that's not what I'm trying to do right now. What we do.
Okay, that's going to be it for today. Um, let's check and see. Seems like I got one more quest. So I've got to kill Captain Melrake. The ruined tower in northern Tiraspol, past Fowl's Rest. Past Fowl's Rest. The ruined tower. Huh. I'm gonna have to look that quest up and oh wait, it's way up here. So I'm not sure how to get up there when there's these elites guarding the area. So I have to find that out in between now and the next video. I'll find out how to get through there. But we've got that one quest, and then to kill Magadai and the Agamon family, which should be fairly easy now, now that we've leveled so much. And then that'll be it. We'll be done with Tears Fall Glades. We're almost done. So, see you next time.